Hey, what's up guys? Technicals here. Short, impromptu, non-edited video. Cubic is continuing its dominance uh, among CPU mining. Epoch number 103 just closed out and payouts are going out right now. Now, I did a video last week where I built another 7900X build. Some people had some reservations about mining Cubic, uh, saying like, oh, the pool fees are too high or it's not going to sustain. Uh, I would agree the pool fees are high and it's probably not going to sustain, but that ain't the case right now. Profits did go down though for this epoch. So we're gonna take a look at what my farm mined. I put all my CPUs on Cubic. We're gonna see what I got versus how much it would have been if I had mined the next most profitable thing, which is Zephyr. Cubic price, not doing too great. Going down, this is the one month chart. So it's, uh, it's gone down quite a bit, almost 40% in one month. And that's why when I get my Cubic, I get rid of it. Uh, because that's kind of a new thing that I'm adopting is Really, only, the only thing I'm holding is Bitcoin. And I know a lot of people is like, oh, well, Clore is great or Dynex is great. Like, I, I don't, you know, I don't, I don't have time to follow them all and keep up with it. And so if I hold all these things and I miss some piece of news, miss an opportunity to dump, and, you know, I'm, you know, I'm going to miss the boat. So uh, Cubic, I'm getting rid of it. And uh, that's kind of what you do uh, on the way down on things is you dump it as soon as you get it. Uh, so right now, going for like uh, six uh, one millionth of a, of a dollar or something. Well, I don't know what that math is, but that's where the price is. Now, last week when we got done with Epoch 102, uh, that was on the third, the price was up significantly more. So it was about uh, seven, 10 billionths or whatever it is. Taking a look, profitability on CPUs for Zephyr has been about the same all week. There has been fluctuation, but in my math, I'm taking it as it is right now. So right now on a 7950X 3D, that's currently taking in about a buck 40 uh, in revenue every day. And so Epoch 103 closing out right now, I was able to get 15 solutions from putting my whole farm on it. Last time, last Epoch, I only got four solutions. And this time I was only taking in about double. So, you know, significantly more power, sig well, not significant, but uh, based on previous, significantly more power, significantly more solutions, uh, what, three, f almost four times as many solutions, uh, and only getting paid out about double. So uh, even with that, though, way more profitable. Running through this real quick, I know it's boring to look at spreadsheets, uh, but right now, 15 solutions found for this epoch. That comes out to about 50, just under $50 based on the price that's, you know, right now. It comes out to about $333 per solution. Last epoch came out to about $741 per solution. So getting into the nitty gritty, if you have one of these CPUs, maybe you can follow along. 7950X 3D, this is the wattage. Uh, this is how much wattage they pull, the cost per day to operate, cost per week to operate and then going into what Zephyr was. So Zephyr, buck 39 revenue, that's revenue, revenue per week, 973 on a 7950X 3D. Um, so our profit per week minus the cost to run it would have been on about 754. So you add them all up for the week. If I had everything on Zephyr, total profit for the week would have been about $21. Going over to Cubic, $49. We're doing it in reverse. We're backing it up. So we took everything as a percentage of the total it's that the CPUs were pulling. So in total, I'm pouring, pulling 453, and that way I can t derive the percentage from there because the solutions are kind of random, it's kind of luck-based, so I'm just kind of trying to compare apples to kumquats as much as I possibly can. Taking it in the revenue per day would have been about 221 for the 7950X3D versus the 170, uh, 139 over on Zephyr. That gives us a profit per day and then our profit per week. So uh, profit per week over on a 7950X3D, 750 over on Cubic, even with everything down 1335, that's 77% more. On the 7900s, about 132% more. And that may be some caused by the variance of me calculating back based on the total its. Uh, and then on the 5900, not so much, but st still 55% more. So Cubic still smashing it. New Epoch just went into effect. So if you want to throw your rigs over on Cubic, uh, I don't have a proper guide on it. Uh, Rabbit mining, that's where I point everybody. So I'll put a link to his guide over in the description below so you can get up, get operating on Cubic. Uh, your CPU has to support AVX 512, I think it is. So a more modern CPU, or I'm not, I, I, just to be honest with you, I have no idea what AVX 512 is, but I know your CPU has to support it in order to mine Cubic. So any modern processor I would think would be able uh, to do that. But for the week, 50 bucks for my four little dinky, little bitty baby CPUs, um, I'll take it. I'll take it all day long. All right, doing a quick math there. I forgot to add that in. So my total profit was $41 versus the 49. So uh, my total profit for the week 
uh, was more than the, you know, like the revenue that Zephyr would even give me. So definitely made sense to stay on Cubic this week. I think I'm going to just continue on because even if this current epoch is a complete dud and is less than what Zephyr would have been, um, yeah, I'm subsidized from the two previous epochs and then I can make a decision to pull off or whatever. Keep an eye on the price, things like that. I'd love to know what you think in the comments below because a lot of people seem to uh, be scared off by that 30% pool fee. I gotta tell you, man, 30, uh, pool's taking 30% and we're still doing numbers like this. It's still worth it because in the end, dollars, nickels is money too. And so, you know, that's, it's making more than I would get somewhere else. Not really interested in holding on to these. I've been mining Zephyr for quite a bit. So my bag of Zephyr is, you know, uh, enough. I'm not worried about getting a bunch of Zephyr before something happens. So um, I'm digging cubic right now. I'm going to get rid of it personally. I'm not holding on to it, but your mileage may vary. Love to know what you think in the comments below. If you like short update videos like this, let me know in the comments below. Like this for more content like this. Subscribe to the channel. I'm a technical. See you next time. <laughs>